We are preparing rice now. We will have rice with vegetables, meat in a creamy sauce for the children, and the girls are making salads. Sushi and pizza restaurants with the beginning of the war began to prepare food for refugees at the railway station, for hospitals and for the children. In the first days, when a lot of people came to Lviv, a small team of cooks and the employees of the establishment prepared from 1,000 to 2,000 portions. People joined, volunteers brought a lot of vegetables, potatoes, carrots, also meat. With these products, we prepared dinners, lunches at railway stations, hospitals, checkpoints. Only recently the team realized that it is necessary to resume the normal work of the enterprise, so now they have opened restaurants for visitors and in parallel continue to cook for refugees. We realize that business should work. We need to support the economy of Ukraine. Of course, we do not do as much as our defenders at the front, but everyone does everything the best he can. So we launched a business so that it continues to work and we give a part of the money to support the armed forces of Ukraine. Some Lviv enterprises did not stop even for a day. Yulia, the manager of the restaurant, says that they worked in full at the beginning of the war because they knew that they needed to support the country's economic front. We did not close our restaurant because we understand that the economy of Ukraine needs the support and, in order to send money to the army, we must earn it. For two days, the Lviv Regional Military Administration received 78 requests to change the place of doing business from the territories where hostilities are taking place. These are companies producing plastic, spare parts for heavy transport, tea and light industry enterprises. Logistics has already been provided for 31 of them. Equipment and components for these industries are already being transported to Lviv region. In general, 276 proposals have been provided to such business to date. Already 31 enterprises have announced the initiative of complete relocation, and right now they are making contraction obligations with the owners of the premises. The leadership of the Lviv region emphasizes that the economy must work. Entrepreneurs are encouraged to go to work, call staff, provide them with work and wages. IDPs are also called to find jobs. Reported by Olena Shustova, Yulia Bil, Lviv, UATV News.